Hello Vikings, Kiagodi here. Welcome to my channel Kiagodi Gaming. In this video, we will talk about gems and the new event that uh, you will have if you start a new server on the second week after you start uh, the new server. It's called Wheel of Fortune this one but before we talk about this event i want to explain to new players and uh, other players that uh, i have some friends they are asking me to explain how to get more gems on this game because from my point of view as a free player you can get a lot of gems daily first of all gems you can get from daily missions if you complete daily missions as you can see you're gonna get 200 gems from here here i don't think you get so from completing only the daily mission you get 200 gems after that when you unlock all four villages you can go and change the village type and if you put a mining village type you're gonna mine gems every day so if you have all four villages you're gonna mine some gems i think between uh, depends on what workers do you have if uh, you have uh, the golden workers on your villages you're gonna get for example this you're gonna get more uh, more gems so i think between uh, uh, 200 and 500 gems per day after that i highly recommend that you join a fully active tribe because and with some spenders at the same time but even even if you don't have spenders you're gonna get a lot of gems doing lead of and niflung leaders and let's see here i don't have the rewards but from packs as you can see here you get 100 and many 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 gems so important that you join a fully active uh, tribe and killing niflungs and niflungs leaders you might have uh, the luck to get gems too so from my point of view it's not very difficult to make gems as a free player or uh, as a dolphin low spender what uh, should do a free player or a dolphin with the gems? I think first of all you should uh, do your best to get to level uh, 6 of VIP prosperity because you're gonna unlock the construction queue in the village so second so you will be able to build uh, to, construct, to have two construction at the same time first step is to go on VIP level 4 after that VIP level 6 you can spend your gems here to buy prosperity points but I think you on the first week don't rush it a lot because as you can see if you have a, a very good tribe here from buying packs uh, you're gonna get some VIP points depends on the level of the packs so you might wait one week at least after you made your VIP level 6 or level 4 at least when you're gonna get hit this event from my point of view this it's a good investment 
to spend your gems because here you're gonna spend 9000 gems to spin nine times but if you go spin 10 times you're gonna spend uh, spend only nine coins so better do the 10 times spins why is this event very good because as you can see the drop rate is very high for this for lead if you already have lead you're gonna get 10 shards if uh, if not you're gonna get the lead you can unlock it so as a free, free player because if not to get lead you're gonna have to buy the daily pack that will give you spending six bucks i don't know it depends on each country but on my country it's like this you're gonna get 15 18 uh, shards some gems some experience points some vip points it's not a bad pack you should you have to buy this don't buy one by one because because you're gonna spend more if you buy this pack the value pack it's a very good pack but if you can spend daily six bucks six euros you have to save all your gems for this event because you're gonna spend uh, 22k per day this event will be three days every week so i i want to remind you uh, on the second week of your uh, server since uh, has been opened this event will be every week for three days so if you want to to spend your gems you will need uh, about 66k gems so let's see if i have luck first we go with our free spin as you can see i got the luck and i got 10 shards in one spin because i already have uh, uh, lead unlocked so let's do 10 spins okay uh, two shards uh, another epic shard uh, see i got another 10 shards in one spin so from my point of view developers uh, they made an update one week ago or two i think and they uh, they adjusted the, the drop rate of the lead shards so they made it a little bit better as you can see with 9k gems i took 10 12 13 lead shards two uh, legendary hero shards that you can use on other heroes or on lead at the same time and some experience books let's try another 10 okay let's see how much luck do you have okay another shard so if you don't get the layer shards you at the same time you have pretty good re rewards as experience books as resources speed up so guys this is my point of view this is a good event as you can see i got this one so i have 10 shards at the same time 12 13 at the same time spinning you make you unlock like some chest so you're gonna get two shards as a free player in three days you're gonna make 66 so you won't gonna get this one if you are a free player but if you are a dolphin you're a low spender you can buy some coins and at least because uh, let's spin because you can do 
As you can see, you can do only 20 times per day with the gems. You see? And they got another two shards. Very good. If you want more, you can go to buy coin packs. So spending, because you're gonna make 66 with gems, you will need to get to 85. Another, help me math. 20, 19 spins, so 19 coins. You're gonna, as a low spender, you're gonna have to spend another six bucks, and you can unlock after that this chest at the end of the third day. I'm gonna get another eight layer shards. Okay, another place where you can spend your gems, and uh, it's a good deal. Go to Honey Tavern, Prosperity Merchant. This as a free player, buy it, guys. Buy it every week because this is gonna help you on many events and other stuff. As a free player, you can buy this one to upgrade your Gathering Heroes if you want. And this one here, you can spend your gems because. It's at 50% and you, but this is the third thing where you can spend. From my point of view, it's first time you spend on VIP, on prosperity level, here, okay. After that, on Wheel of Fortune. Because let me show you, as you can see, after I spin 22k gems, I made 46 lead uh, shards. So, not bad, guys. And I had some before, and I think it's five of these ones. So, guys, hitting. Uh, James is not very difficult in this game. Important. Two, three things. Be active daily. Do your best to join uh, an active clan. I am... Um, we have babes. We are first. But if you join on second or third, I'm sure you're gonna get uh, some good prizes. So... First of all, I, have, I want to say hi to our uh, tribe members, we love babes. So yeah guys, if you want to join us, we are on server 98. My previous videos were made from 71, but uh, I changed the server because I made some mistakes there and I wanted to have a better, rest, uh, better start this server so i got lucky because we have pretty good players that uh, have experience at the same time you need players with experience that know how to play this game so as a new player that you never played this game will help you a lot so another thing what should i say do your best to make chronicles because you're gonna get a lot of gems from here too as you can see, 100, 100, so if you hear our server, it looks like it's low uh, on players, because we got only 4.3k, but if you have a fully active server, you're gonna get a lot of gems, as you can see, so pretty it's not difficult in this game from my point of view to make your gems so a free player can have this hero with no be problem honest. okay because this hero is pretty good with pikemen and pvp so as a free player i am gonna make another video about heroes and how to what is best to watch hero is best to take as a free player and uh, as a dolphin okay i upgraded tomorrow i have i hope i will have more luck 
and I upgrade more because this is a pretty good hero okay guys thank you for watching I hope uh, I helped you with some tips about uh, spending gems and how to make uh, gems in this game and uh, see you on next, our next video